Hello fellow engineers and welcome back to Mini Motorways. Last time we put a pretty good score in Munich, but we still haven't cracked 2000 yet, which is absolutely terrible. <laughs> For shame! Uh, but today we're going to be using Extreme Segregation uh, to hopefully crack that 2000 point limit. I feel this could be the solution to a high score in this game. Now you might be asking yourself, what do I mean by Extreme Segregation? Oh god, oh no. Hang on a sec. Thank you game for a great start. Really, really appreciated. Yeah, we're doing that. We're going direct and we're going segregation for the win. So essentially now we've got two houses connected to this blue slice of bread, which isn't actually a blue slice of bread, although they may sell a blue slice of bread because this is actually a supermarket. If you haven't seen this game before, the aim is to connect the colored houses to the colored shops that they want to visit. And each one of these upside down supermarket bags is a journey. So that one just went into the blue car and now the blue car will head back to his little house and then we'll gain a point at the top right. Lovely. And as the game goes on, it gets more and more complex. There's more different colors and they're all intermingled and all sorts. And oh, it's, it's horrible. It is horrible. Uh, but my plan today is to use extreme segregation. Unfortunately, <laughs> it, it really hasn't given me the best start to do that. I'm going to go close to there in the hope that maybe some blue houses could spawn along that strip. Yeah, but then we're just coming straight up to that. Sorted. So you can see now our red houses do not mix with our blue houses. The downside with this is these longer routes, a bit later on in the game, it gets a bit mental. Because I think these, these shopping bags, they rack up pretty quickly. And the time it takes for your cars to get there can't actually keep up. And if you're wondering how the game finishes, so if, you're, if your supermarket fills up with these journeys, like you can't get enough cars to pick them up, uh, the entire city just shuts down. Aha, so we have a yellow which we can bring this way and go straight across there. Oh no, we've run out of road tiles. No, we can't go straight across there. <laughs> All right, so at the end of every week, such as this one, the end of week one, we get to pick between upgrades. We've got the roundabout and the bridge. Because I've just noticed this yellow house there, I'm probably going to go bridge. Otherwise, there's not going to be any way to connect that. I'll show you what I mean now. This house, because of where it's located, I can't go under this one. So we have to go around like that. And this little thing, it's, it's a bridge. An engineer's favorite tool. So my extreme segregation idea is not only splitting the colors up, but I'm also going to like split up colors within colors. <laughs> Does that make sense? So I'm pretty confident two or three houses should satisfy a supermarket. So for example, if I were to get, I don't know, maybe five blue houses here, I wouldn't connect them all up. I would try and take them to another dark blue shop. Yeah, okay. So, so this is a prime example. So... We've got three houses up here and one house there. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to disconnect that house and connect him straight to there. This house, we're going to ruin this guy's lovely garden. He now looks onto this guy's driveway. Uh, but this one, we're, go we're going to bring it over here. So now the reds, even though they're, they're both reds, they're both the same color, they are now segregated. Uh, in the meantime, the level has expanded. So I'm going to reclaim a bridge. And I'm also going to mess up this guy's driveway. So we have an extra bridge now. And now it's the end of week two. So traffic lights, they can be used, I guess, positively. But I'm not smart enough. So I'm just going to go road tiles. 30 road tiles is way better than 20 road tiles and two traffic lights, in my opinion. Uh, meanwhile, our extreme segregation methods are not going well. We've just had this dark blue spawn onto the yellow road, directly onto it. Also this house trying to mingle with the reds. No, 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 you must go up that way. So the trouble we have is there aren't many ways round without lots of bridges. So I'm sort of thinking, it's, it's very early on to do this, I'm thinking we do a complete rework of this, a complete rehash. So we're actually going to do it like that, that will just give us a little bit more room for now. Aha, we've got a new colour. So no, this isn't a slice of bread. This is actually a white supermarket. Unfortunately, a white house has spawned in the middle of that area. That's just a complete waste. It's never going to get used. Uh, so the bottom one's going to have to satisfy for now. I'm not connecting that up at all. You are staying segregated, mate. All right, so it's week three. Unfortunately, no bridge. That's very, very disappointing. Uh, we've got a roundabout or we could go with a tunnel. I think the amount of like mountains that we have to go through, we're going to use the tunnels. So these dark red areas, they're the places we have to tunnel through. Aha, and we have a green. So I'm just going to hit pause. I think we're pretty lucky in that we picked tunnel, which means we can come through here. 
and go out to there. You might wonder why I've done like windy. I didn't just go straight to it. You can't connect a tunnel straight to a house. Hence, we're a wee bit windy. There's another greenhouse there, so I'll connect you straight down. We've got a blue spawn down there. That's a little bit annoying. Now, hopefully we can get a bridge. Still no bridges, game. What are you doing to me? Uh, but I'm pretty sure tunnel will help us out in this situation. Yeah, but this blue, rather than crossing over the yellow path and getting really confusing, I'm going to go up and around the yellow and do that sort of thing. So for now, we've just got one blue fueling this. Uh, hopefully some more will spawn and we'll add some more in. Uh, we just had a white spawn there. Oh, and another one. Balls. <laughs> That's really not ideal. The game has decided my intentions were wrong. So what we're going to do, we're going to press pause. Right, we've got two blue houses here. We've got no bridges or tunnels. Okay, three houses now. Still no bridges or tunnels. So pretty much nothing we can do. Uh, but just wait for the end of the week and hope we get something good. I'd love a motorway, actually. Yes, we've got a motorway. We are saved. So I've connected these blue houses up. And they're going to be the ones to fuel all the stuff in the middle, if we can. So we're going to go from there. And motorways can just fly over the top of everything. Look at that. Whoa. So we're going to make our motorway finish there. The road is going to come off and then it's going to go up to fuel that IMAX and down to help fuel this supermarket as well. So if we press play now, I think we've made things better thanks to the motorway. Uh, and that's annoying. <laughs> so this pink house that spawned in the worst place possible. We're just literally going to have to cut across everything and go straight to there. That is an absolutely horrid design. Double crossroads. Uh, we've got a yellow house spawn in the top right, absolutely Lovely. miles away from anything useful. In the meantime, everything looking pretty healthy. We've just had another little cheeky red house spawn there. And it's the end of week six. We can go for a bridge or a tunnel. Is it possible to see the level? I can't remember what I said I needed. <laughs> tunnel could save me when the game spawns some dodgy things. So I'm going to go tunnel. Yeah, and I might even think, now I've got the tunnel, is it worth taking this red straight up there? And I'm going to say yes, because we get rid of two crossroads if we do that. And we're going to send you, Mr. Red, up to about there and then straight up. Sorted. Uh, this is not ideal at all, though. Oh, God. It's an IMAX. Really, game? Are you kidding me? All right, and honestly, I feel like the motorway could be needed. So I'm really sorry, motorway, but you're not going to be for blues anymore. So if we put our motorway there, we can do a road straight up. And this end of the motorway can go over to these houses, which can all connect in like that. Now, unfortunately, motorways, you can't put them over mountains. So that's as close as we can get. Now, thankfully, we can, we can make them a little bit neater like that. Yeah, there's, there's a lot more yellow spawning up there. So we'll definitely try and connect these in. Right, and it's the end of week seven and we've got another motorway. I feel like that's a very long time to get your second motorway, but... Now, I could put the blue motorway back in. Uh, yeah, I think I will do that, actually. Why not? Let's press pause. And once everything's, like, sorted out, it'll be nice and clear. There you go. So now we've got four yellow houses connected to the square brioche, which should be enough even when it upgrades to an IMAX to cope. So that's why it was giving me loads of yellows, because we've got a new square brioche down the bottom. Right, we just got another yellow spawn there, so that's perfect to go onto our new road, actually. Another yellow just spawned under that motorway, too. <laughs> that's literally the worst place on the map. Yeah, yellow's spawning everywhere. Oh, really, game? What are you doing to me? So the blue has decided to cock up what was being quite a good run. I'm going to take blues up here, but there aren't really enough. All right, another green there. Let's quickly, before the game does anything stupid bagsy this space so we don't need a tunnel so that's three greenhouses connected to the moldy slice of bread and it's week eight tunnel or roundabout we're definitely doing tunnel and then we might be able to clear up some stuff so we could bring motorway one down to here and tunnel through that bit so it's a similar length for this imax but it then fuels these houses down here i think that's better all right there we go there we go all connected now Ooh, and it's a good thing we removed that because this white has just upgraded to an IMAX. The milk carton is now a milk bottle. <laughs> uh, we've got a load of white houses spawning down here. That's really not going to help. But I tell you what, that one is going to help. Thank you, game. That's the four we need. I don't think we need any more white houses to fuel the IMAX. Oh, God. Right. So up here isn't going well. 
we've got oh all the dark blues are doing terribly i feel like we just don't have enough houses going to the blues yeah so we've got one two three four five houses fueling two supermarkets and an imax yeah, it's just not enough it's just not enough Ooh, and that's not good we've now got a white imax under there and there's only two houses connected to it uh, it's the end of the week tunnel or bridge i feel like with a bridge we might be able to do some jiggery pokery let's grab a bridge and we'll press pause right with a bridge we could potentially fuel this imax i'm also thinking rejig this tunnel and then blues i'm thinking we come up this way and go straight across like that sort of thing and the greens can come straight down and connect like that yeah although there's always something isn't there and this time it's a new supermarket down there that's dreadful god right let's press pause <laughs> we disconnect these yellow houses from the motorway so now these houses up here they're only fueling this imax all the greens come down go to this supermarket or they can come across and connect onto this road like it's going to be a shared road but they're both going to the same place so that's fine like that and then down here there's really not many solutions especially with the amount of tiles i got left whether we have enough houses connected not entirely sure but <laughs> we hit a thousand points at least thank goodness right it's week 10 and we've got a motorway thank goodness uh, where would be the best place to use that whoa this cymax is dying bad what happened oh that might lose the game come on cars come on come on come on come on come on look he's coming in he's pulling in timer down oh we're saved i think we're saved meanwhile a new green supermarket spawned down here i've just connected that up you know i tell you what actually i've just realized we can connect the yellows in a segregated manner because we can do that and we can do this motorway straight in so we can take that one there and then connect this motorway straight down to there and then delete all of that nonsense <laughs> this is stressful man this is stressful Right, so I've sort of just realized there's a little bit, a little bit of a fix we could do because we do have a spare tunnel. So we could make this blue a bit more efficient and then include this extra house for the pink. So if we delete that road, connect those in like that. These pinks now come down here, uh, but it also means we can add these ones in. And I think that's a much better solution. I could probably even delete those and just join them together like that it's yeah, so week 11 tunnel or motorway of course we're going motorway the most useful thing in the game and we're gonna save that as well i don't think there's anywhere that's too urgently in need surprisingly <laughs> now i think we will connect this oh dark blue in up there all right so it looks like we're coming up to a high score we've never got to 2000 points before 2000 journeys made uh, finally looks like we might actually do it actually i'm thinking we've got we got a crossroads here maybe it would be better if we did the whites because we've got we've basically got two crossroads to connect the whites in at our current layout so if we delete all of that delete all of that yeah, but essentially i'm thinking on that off there with the whites and they can just connect in there that's a lot quicker and it means we've only got one conflict ah oh, bollocks now we've got a red over there. That could be a motorway situation. Uh, there is a red house down here. It's just where the more spawn. I can see there's a lot of spare reds up the top. I think something like that. Uh, I've royally screwed up these yellows by moving that motorway. Oh, that's a big mistake. I need that one to come back. Oh, I might have cocked it. I was on for good points. Why did I move the motorway? Rebuild. Go, go, go. <laughs> Look at them all leaving. Go. <laughs> Oh no, I ruined it. They're not going to get there in time. I was actually on for a top score then. Look how close those cars are. Those yellow cars are going in. Just park, park. Oh, it's so close to parking. Oh, well, that was our best score yet. And although a bit of a ropey start, I feel like I've got the hang. Maybe next time we'll actually push for some proper high scores. I feel like I know what I'm doing. I know good strategies. I know the bad strategies. Uh, and now I know moving motorways in the middle of a game not ideal but yes our highest score yet one of our best rankings yet all thanks to extreme segregation unfortunately we're beaten by a bumble butt <laughs> i don't even want to know anyway guys peace love and motorways and i'll catch you guys next time bye